mouthful. A land of oil-rich food and clothes that jangle as you walk. At least that's how we've seen it many times on screen. But now a new movie made by two novice filmmakers claims to portray Southall as a place of gangsters and mayhem. We sent Tommy to find out. Yari, cha -cha. Come on, man. Triads, Yardies and Onion Bargies. Sounds like a comedy, but this movie is about crime, revenge and Asian gangsters. The main character, Singh, is played by Manish Patel, whose novel The Stone Shiva is what the film was based on. I caught up with Manish to talk movies, mysticism and thug life. Manish, you've written and now you've produced and acted in your own film. Tell us what it's about. If you can imagine guns, gangsters, girls, but with an ethnic twist, right. that's what this film is. One of the main plots we have is based on a, a real-life event, which was the $6 million robbery from Heathrow Airport. Jump to the fucking ground! Another plot involving the importation of cocaine <laughs> into the country inside onion bargies. Here, have a fucking onion bargie. So that is essentially the, the plot, the, the missing $6 million. Yeah. Who's flooding London town with all this cocaine? All the, all the major established drug barons, they're going mad because yeah. they're thinking, where, where are these drugs coming from? <laughs> Whoa. And your character that you play in the film, what's, what's that character about? My, my character's Singh. Uh, Singh is basically a dark, brooding character. Really? Yes, he's uh, kind of an enforcer. He's uh, a member of this, uh, this Asian gang called the Holy Smokes. This incident has greatly shamed our organisation. Now, you've used the references to the goddess Kali in the film. Yeah. What many people don't understand is the word thug comes from the word thuggy, which is a Hindi word. And in India, there was a cult of assassins, and they were called the thuggy. And they used to worship Kali, who was their goddess of death. And I thought, what a fantastic idea if this gang, the Holy Smokes, this mean, broody gang in Southall, they were a cult of assassins and they worshipped Kali. Sergeant Baines was a director of the movie. It was his job to come up with the film's strong visual style. The film is very gritty. Yeah. Uh, it's raw. The action is quite real. Yeah. Um, the violence is very real. I'm gonna hurt ya! The way I've, I've, I've edited this film and I've shot this film is, is, is from the influence of photographers like Sebastian Salgado. Well, I've looked at their style and the grittiness, their portrayal of people in the world. All that kind of influence is come into this film. The Asian community is going to love this film. Yeah. The other communities are going to love it because it's something new. It's not Bend It Like Beckham. Yeah. It's not East is East. It's not Bargy on the Beach. No. This is your Asian guy coming from behind the counter of his shop saying, I've had enough. Yeah. This is it. Don't mess with me. This is something you don't want to miss, believe me. The movie gets its world premiere later this year at the Cannes Film Festival. And if all goes well, you could be seeing Triads, Yardies and Onion Bargies on general release.